I'll come out and say it, which is that I have basically no process when it comes to handling care plan client requests. Things like change this image or this text all come straight to me in email. And although I have a wonderful contracted developer that is basically ready for me anytime, I don't really have a great way to offload those tasks to him without there being some kind of process that would take longer than it would for me to just go and do it. A few things that are really important to me in this process are not introducing new software. We already use Basecamp for everything anyway, so I don't want a new subscription to Help Scout or Zoho or any of the other products out there that have shared inboxes. On that note of inboxes, I do not want to be doing this out of email anymore, and I also don't want my developer or anybody in the future to have individualized email addresses that if they leave or move on, suddenly are stranded and there's all kinds of information going to them that just sounds like a future nightmare. So I'm going to show you inside Basecamp how I've discovered this can work, but I imagine this is not just applicable to Basecamp. If you use ClickUp or Trello or any of those other kind of project management systems, they probably have some way that you could take this idea and run with it. So the way that I envision this working, and again, this is in the trial phases right now, is we're going to have a project inside of Basecamp called Care Plan Clients. And in this, we really only need a couple of tools here. So we don't typically use the live chat because we, we use message boards and we have like kind of an internal company chat. So we don't really need that. Uh, these other ones are totally fine. And then I would just add my team members here. So I have my developer and my designer on here. And now what we need to do is go ahead and turn on one other tool that really is the crux of making this work. So Basecamp offers this email forwards feature and I know a lot of project management systems do that. So we get a unique email address right here and we can forward in emails that will go to this project, which is exactly what we want, but it gets even better than that. So I've gone ahead and sent an email to this address so we can see what happens here in just a second. It'll pop in down here. And there it is. So this creates a new message thread here in Basecamp, which is awesome because I can see the information that's in the original message. We still have all the original links, but the way that this really works super effectively for me internally is going to be that we can add a message directly to our team members. So if somebody was confused and they were like, wait, what domain is this on? You can see this says only people on this project are gonna see what you write. So I could add this comment and then I could at my team member so they get a notification and start seeing things in the future. But almost more exciting than that, if there's something that's just, you know, like we use our little text expander shortcut, then what I could do is reply directly to the client. And it says, now anything you write below will be emailed directly to our client. Of course, in this case, just being a demo project, it's me. So we can switch back and forth. You know, if we wanna send this reply, that's going to get emailed directly to them. And then on the client side, they don't even need to be in this project. They can just respond directly to the email they get, whether it's attachments or anything like that, they all get dumped right here. Then if we needed an internal team message, you know, we could just say like, this is a test. I can tag my team member and add this. And then now we have a very clear distinction, like this was an email sent to the client and this was an internal message. Because these are just care plan requests, they're going to be really simple, typically done in just a couple of minutes. So there's not going to be a whole lot of headache like if we're trying to develop an entirely new project. So this for me is going to be the absolute best way for us to handle this. We have one project where all care plan requests are gonna come into. Maybe long-term this won't work. Maybe there's some gotchas I'm not anticipating just yet, but I think for now this is going to do the trick. Really quite a simple video, but something that has been kind of problematic for me in my business in the past. Things have fallen through the cracks because like I mentioned, it's all in email, but I'm looking to stop that. And the way that I'm gonna do it is with my existing tools and just a little bit of creativity. So hope this was helpful for you. If you have any thoughts on this or curious about some of the other workflow things that I do, definitely let me know and I'll look forward to seeing you in a future video.